this video, I will cover how to import audit files to Tenable.io. Let's go ahead and get started. First of all, what is an audit file and what do you use it for? In simple terms, an audit file is an XML based text file used to audit specific configurations, file permissions, and access controls of many platform types. When preparing for a compliance scan, you must first create a template that utilizes the audit files you want. Tenable has created a predefined policy compliance auditing template that is required to be used as a starting point to ensure that all the necessary settings are configured. To access that template, click the three stacked lines in the top left corner, scroll down to templates, and then click the plus sign to create a template you'll see the policy compliance auditing template. We're going to go ahead and select that. First, we need to go ahead and fill out this template. And then the last step will be to upload the audit file. So I always think it's a good practice to include the name of the audit file in the name of the template. So you know right away what the audit is for. In the description box, make a note of what was changed in the audit file. Just a brief summary. And then I'm going to configure this for Windows. And then all templates that you create that use an audit file require administrative or root like credentials. I'm going to go ahead and input one for Windows. and hit save at the bottom. And then the last step is to configure your compliance audit. So we're gonna go ahead and choose add. And then in the pop-up window, you're gonna go ahead and select the platform that you're gonna be scanning. So in my case, it's a Windows server, so I'm gonna click on Windows. And when you click on that down arrow, it drops down a list of all the current audits that Tenable has available to you. And if you've taken one and modified it, you're going to use the top option, which is upload a custom audit file. Then you go ahead and add the file and browse to the location where your modified audit file lives. Select it and choose open. It's important to save at the bottom that actually uploads the file to the template. And then hit save again. That saves the actual template. Now you should see your template listed under templates, so it's now ready for you to use in a scan.